forget about ever picking up the phone because you can now automate all your calls with AI. Imagine an AI agent that answers every call, helps your customers while also gathering information and updating records in the background. Well, this isn't some far off future anymore because you can literally build an AI agent like this in just five minutes with no code or technical skills. Like this agent I built to help solve AI issues. Hey, I'm Neo, your AI assistant. How can I help? I set up the Siri and ChatGPT extension and it isn't working. Let's figure this out together. Are you using the ChatGPT Siri extension on an iPhone or a Mac? On the Mac. Next, have you updated the ChatGPT app to the latest version? You can check this by opening the ChatGPT app, clicking on the ChatGPT name in the top menu bar, and selecting Check for Update. Let me know if it's updated or if you need to update it. Uh, we're up to date. Awesome. Do you have an active paid ChatGPT subscription? Like ChatGPT Plus? Great. Now let's make sure that the ChatGPT Siri extension is activated on your Mac. If by the end of the call the problem is still not solved, my agent will get customers' information and create a support ticket directly in my Jira account. Could you please provide your name, email, and any additional details about the issue you'd like to share? This will help us create a support ticket for further assistance. My name is Tonya and my email is youraiworkflow at gmail.com. I've created a support ticket for your issue, Tonya. Our team will look into it and get back to you as soon as possible. To create this agent, you will need 11 Labs and Make.com. 11 Labs is the best AI speech tool out there, and you'll be using it as the base of your AI agent. You can get your first 10,000 free credits with my link in the description of this video. Make.com will connect your agent to another platform. It will perform actions like generating leads or creating support tickets. You can also create a free account with my link in the description. So the first thing you're going to do is go to 11 Labs and click Conversational AI, and you will get a list of agents over over here. Now, you can either choose from one of the templates or start from blank if you're creating one from scratch. You're going to choose your languages next. Eleven Labs models are actually multilingual, meaning that your AI agents will be able to speak up to 30 different languages. So in the agent language, choose the primary one, and you could also add more here in the additional languages. You're going to set up your first message first. This is basically how the AI agent will introduce itself when the call starts. So just type in something quick and easy. Next, you'll set up your system prompt. This is incredibly important. Not only do you need to define the tone and style of your agent, but you also need to tell it exactly how to act. In my example, it's very important to specify that the agent first needs to ask questions one by one to identify the issue and only then fix it. We don't want it blurting out all questions at once. And if the issue still persists after all the questions, a support ticket needs to be created. If you're interested, I leave the full setup guide for this AI agent in the description so we don't have to waste time on details. Now choose your LLM. This is basically the AI system your bot will use as a base. For me, nothing can really beat the ChatGPT 4.0 with how smart it is, so that's definitely my choice. Next, you'll need to upload your knowledge base. Now, ChatGPT 4.0 is already very smart, so no need to upload common knowledge. You will only need to upload information that is specific to your case. You can either upload URLs, documents, or just plain text, but I actually don't recommend just dumping all the information here. Instead, I think you should use a similar structure, kind of like a flowchart, telling the bot exactly what to do in each situation. You'll find that template in the description as well. Next, you'll set up tools. So tools basically let your AI agent connect to other platforms and automate all processes. Like you could add one for creating support tickets or generating a lead when a prospect calls. The possibilities here are really endless. The setup is going to be pretty custom for each case, but I'm going to show you how I built my example for creating Jira tickets. And it might look very scary at first, but don't worry, it is so easy to set up. The idea is as follows. If the problem can't be solved, the agent will ask for contact details before creating a ticket. Our tool will then summarize the transcript, send specific details to make.com via webhook, and the webhook will send the details over to Jira. So to set this up, first go to make.com and click add a new scenario, and we're going to choose custom webhook. We need to copy this URL. Now go back to your 11 Labs AI agent and click add a new tool. Give it a name and shortly describe what this webhook will do. Choose the post method and add the link that we copied before. Now scroll down to body parameters, click enable, and here you need to quickly explain how the LLM will extract the information from your transcript. Now you'll need to add properties for each piece of information you will need. In my case, it's going to be Jira fields like name, email, issue description, and so on. 
We'll need to test the steps, so click Run once in Make and test your AI agent in 11 labs. You'll need to call your bot and ask it to test the webhook together. We're testing a webhook. Can you please create a test Jira ticket for me? I'll need a bit more information to create the test Jira ticket for you. Now go back to Make and check that everything worked correctly. And if it has, click plus next to the webhook and add another platform. For me, it's going to be Jira. I'm going to click create a new issue and I will need to map out the fields matching the Jira fields with the properties we extracted from the transcript. And that's all you need to do. Test the step again, just like we did before. And here's my Jira ticket. Now all you need to do is publish your scenario in the automation is ready. Now that our agent is fully configured, let's add some finishing touches. You can go to the voice tab over here and choose the voice you like. I really like Eric for this. I think he sounds so natural, but you could even clone your voice and use it. I'll cover voice cloning my next video, so make sure to subscribe. Now, all that's left to do is to share our agent with our users. You can set up your Twilio phone numbers here on the left. So when someone calls your number, the AI agent will answer instead. We can also copy this link at the top and paste it somewhere on our website. But what I love the most about the Eleven Labs is this widget thingy over here. We can customize our text here, colors, and even add terms and conditions so users understand what they're doing. And once everything is ready, just copy the embed code and post it somewhere on your website. Let's quickly test how it works by clicking the call support button. Hey, I'm Neo, your AI assistant. How can I help? I'm super excited about this new feature and I really think it's going to transform our lives and your guys' businesses. Now, I know it's a little bit controversial given that it might take away jobs, but I actually think it might open more possibilities for people to earn money online. I would really like to know what you think about it, so make sure to leave your opinion in the comments. And if you're struggling building those AI agents, make sure to drop me a message. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.